Alright, right, back for some more Forspoken. Got all the bad guys in. After I failed okay, miserably. We grab what we can. Last time. good <laughs> I'll take that as a yes <laughs> I think we lost them he's completely mad yeah too far gone for anyone's good corrupted by the break well break Bob here is the best shot I got at leaving so that's quite worrisome be honest, I don't care what you think. I do have an investment in your decisions. Where thou goest, there go I and all that. Yeah, well, whatever magic bound us when I got here, hopefully will unbind when I get back. Pity. I was growing so fond of our partnership. Oh, I wish I could say the same. <laughs> you say something, dear. No, oh, no, just thinking out loud. Wonderful. I do that a lot. Or I think I do. Maybe I don't. Hard to separate the voice inside my head from any other. You know what? I understand you completely. Tell me about where you come from. Uh, it's a city much bigger than Sapal. It's called New York. Oh, ah, uh, yes, I know it. You do? Or I don't. The name is sitting there on the edge of memory, peeking through the fog. Or maybe I dreamt it. it. It sounds like a place I should know. Perhaps I've heard it spoken of. Have you told me of it? Maybe that, maybe you said something. Yes. Oh, he's going to be essential. Knock it off. <laughs> Sapal. Shit. Is Sapal on fire? It does appear to be smoldering somewhat. Come on. Ready before you continue. Yet. Okay. All right. huh. Let's see how long it takes before I die. Nope, through the door. Here. She walks among us! Tanta Sila! She seeks the one called Frey. Me? Your arrival must have sent tremors across Afia. Your presence here has the Tanta frightened. Frey! You're back! Olivia! What is all this? I was wrong. She didn't come to rescue us. You did. I I'm no hero. Tanta Sila has Odin. Odin? My Odin. She Bob! Break Bob! Your concern for the madman is admirable, but first we must stop Sila. It's okay, I'll try and fix this. I can help. No. 
Absolutely not. You're gonna stay here and find somewhere to hide. There's no way we could defeat her! Captain Silas destroying the city! <laughs> Get on your mark. Get on your mark. On your mark. On your mark. There Lord we go. Lorden! She's up in the square! You have to hurry! Yeah, no. Alright, I'll keep going. Wait, I thought I saw... Why is she attacking the city? Tonta Silas in the city, and she's out for blood! People are dying! Dying. Let's go get murdered. She is the one who freed the demon! Please, your highness, your anger will not serve us now. Tell Tanta Sila where she is, child. Where is the interloper, child? The one who dares trespass upon my realm? Tanta Sila. I am Robin King. Father. Morton. I served faithfully under Tanta Sinter. My wife Callista was a general in your army. Have mercy on my daughter. Robian Keen. I've not heard that name in a long time. You have to save the peasant girl. She would do the same for you. Ah, oh, fuck. I know. Where is she? We have to do something. See if you can sneak up behind her. Try to blend in with the crowd. I could blend in a whole lot better if you shut the fuck up. Okay, you can't go that way, and we spill water. Nice guards here. Let's go there. Quickly, the peasant girl needs your help. It's your entreaties! How few times? Your daughter pays the interloper! And what's right? She refuses to reveal her whereabouts! Someone must pay for such treacheries! Understand! Aside! Listen to uh. me! There we go. Hey, come on. I'll explain it later. Stop! You must stop! She can save us! She can end your madness! Whoa! Father! What the hell kind of craziness is this? Tanta Sila has the power to change the state of matter and being. She was using one of her minions as a vessel. Oh, wait, what's it doing now? Probably. Don't move. 
Oof. Should have dodged that, but I didn't. So. My magic isn't doing anything. It must be protected somehow. Ready for this? Think fast. This one's no run of the mill silo drone. Have we? We'll find out. Nope, not working. Let's try it. Of course we did. Stamina plus 100. Cool. Countless fallen, and all because of this demon. You saw what she did. She will kill us all. Surely, Councilwoman Belette. Surely you agree with me. Yes. Seize her. No, 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 no. Th this young woman is our protector. She'll save us. He is as corrupted as she is. Seize them all before the darkness spreads. You will do nothing of the kind. Obin Keen is wise beyond measure, and has always been a man of his word. Had we known he was still alive, he would be sitting on the council, not you. And this young woman has brought him back to us. Welcome home, old friend. Tantor Silas' attack shows us one thing. The enemy of our enemy is our friend. And how many further agonies must we suffer? Her presence has cost us too many lives. Councilwoman Belette is right. Tantor Sila will surely visit her wrath upon us once more. A clear majority. The girl must be surrendered to Tanta Sila at once. No need. I'll go to her myself. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna be better with the um combat. The intro new arc of entry has been added. Your magic is now. Ah, uh, yeah, just in case. We'll use that one for now. I should have used slot four. But don't delete it. What must be done? Chapter four. 
Here we go again. An oath of vengeance. Crafting tape. You don't have enough materials, I'm having. I need some of that. Purple magic, but get a helicopter. Of course, I think purple magic. All right, uh, that's enough crafting. Let's get going. Good morning, Frey. Here are the notes on the Tehran I promised you. Look, about our deal. Your dad's journals all got burnt up in the guild when we escaped. It's fine. Frey, you brought him back. That's far more important. That's more than I could ever have hoped for. Here. Thank you. So, uh, where can I find Sila? You should visit the archives in Upper Sapol. You'll be able to find out more about her there. The archives. Got it. Alden, sorry to bother you, but I just saw your father wandering off. Uh, forgive me, Frey. I need to go and find him. It says a white journal containing Rovian's notes on the phenomenon, phenomena known as Tirana. One of its pages reads as follows. Much remains mysterious about the Turana. They make instantaneous locomotion possible by altering space and time. But precisely how, I cannot say. The energy required to open one is enormous and increases exponentially the farther one wishes to travel. And yet, I cannot help but wonder. By channeling enough power into one, could we reach another continent? Perhaps even another world. No, you're crazy. Right. Off to the archives we go. I am kind of worried about Bob, though. He is my ticket out of here. Yeah, Bob. <sighs> Do what you want. But remember, we have a Tunter to defeat. Can I just read that? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, you can't go down there. Yeah, invisible wall, invisible wall there. You're Frey, aren't you? The one who used their amazing powers to drive back the monsters. I'm Pilo. Can't believe I'm talking to the hero who saved the city. I'm not a hero. Not now, never will be. Did you want something? Um, just wondering if there's anything I can do. I don't know, I could... Hey, I could show you around town. You haven't been here long, right? A guided tour, what an excellent idea. Certainly couldn't hurt to get the lay no, of the land. No, thanks, but I'm not in the mood. Oh, don't say that. Look, I'll be waiting for you, all right? When you're ready, just let me know. I'm going to check the map. 
Details, okay. Hey, side quest. If you visit certain marked locations or talk to marked NPCs, you, you can occasionally take on special side quests. As the story progresses, these may become unavailable, so be sure to take them on while you have the chance. Alright. Yeah. Decided to take me up on my offer? Oh, let's have a look. Okay, bet. Give me the tour. Great! This is great! All right. We'll start at the square in the lower city. This way. Come on, follow me. All right. We'll follow you. Whoops, I'm here. Ah, oh, it's gonna... The lower city is where all the refugees live. And the square, here, is its heart. Are you a refugee? My parents were. I was born here. In the days before the break, Sipal wasn't much more than a quiet collection of buildings standing serenely amid the beauty of nature. Despite the ravages of time and recent events, O'Brana Square re retains the tranquility of this peaceful past with its sweeping stairway and dignified stone pillars creating a sense of airy openness. Townspeople gather here at all hours of the day to exchange goods and inform or just pass time. Sepal are born and bred, huh? Anyone my age or younger pretty much has to be. <laughs> Those kids just disappeared. I need to ask Bob about those Tyrannus. You're young Olivia's friend. Hello. This is the girl Olivia was talking about. The, the amazing girl? Oh, come on. I wouldn't go that far. No. Olivia used to look after my elf a lot, you know. But I never heard her talk about another grown-up like she did you. You must have been very special to her. You think so? And she was special to you too, I imagine. Um, that one. <laughs> she was forever stealing things. And she never listened to anyone. But then, I suppose that's what made her such a little character. And such a handful. She was just doing what she needed to survive. Hmm. Something tells me you know a little bit about that yourself. I guess you could say that. We were even more alike than I realized. Tanta Saiba was a mighty warrior. I'd watch yourself out there if I were you. was just pondering the fleeting nature of life. One moment, we are laughing together, not a care in the world. The next, we are naught but dust on the wind. What good can come of love in such a time? Surely it can only end in tragedy. I hate to say it, but you might be right. Some music, perhaps? Though I fear it will do precious little to lift the mood. Uh, not right now. What a pity. Shall we? Alright. How long is this tool? Oh, 
Alden's over the moon to have her father back. I don't think I've ever seen her. Oh, sorry, you were still talking. Around here is basically your turf. A shame it's barely fit for human habitation. Do the buildings around here just not get fixed? Sometimes. But we're not a priority down here. The upper city comes first. In that, and in everything else. That sucks. Up there is where we get our water. Uh, I've seen that already. Thank you, though. Oh, really? All right, then. Let me show you something else. Right, excuse me. Out the way. What, what are you doing? I don't know what he was doing then. Letting someone like that roam the streets unsupervised. Hey, mommy, mommy, that's the lady. Shush you, and you don't go near her. You hear? Hey, that's no way to. It's cool. I'm used to it. True. <laughs> I was rather hoping to see that fiery temper of yours in action. Petty, small-minded gossips. Although, I suppose it is pretty frightening. With your power, you could turn the whole town on its head just like that. Yeah. There's something else, all right. Not this shit again. I'm nobody. Get over it already. Stop being so angry, Freya. Hey! Do you like animals? They're all right, I guess. Great! You like this, then? Okay. Head to Kiski Meadow. Maybe you could do an Assassin's Creed dive off this bridge. I'll try that later. Here I can. Right. Over here is where we keep all the livestock. We don't get to eat meat very often, but we do all right, I suppose. Hey, you can't create food out of thin air, can you? Never mind. <laughs> With this peaceful pasture, with its free roaming sheep, I'd be relaxing in another setting. Its proximity to the city graveyard lends it an eerie air that keeps most visitors at bay. Meat is hard to come by in Sapal these days, and despite trying to increase output, all attempts have been met with misfortune of one kind or another, be it disease or outright theft. The big open area is the graveyard. Rich or poor, we all end up there in the end. A farm and a cemetery. You don't see that often. Really? It's quite a good arrangement. The animals help keep the grass down. Hmm. Come on. Let's go and take a closer look. All right. I wonder if I should have done this. No. They're not shy, that's for sure. Well, we don't get many new faces in town. Hey, why don't you try feeding them? Really? Is that allowed? Of course! Wait here! I'll go and grab some food. Detours feeding the sheep. Try feeding hungry sheep and feeding them. You can use couch. Which ones have worked? Worked up an appetite. Just go up to one of them and hold out your hand. Get on the new mark. Fed the sheep. Okay. This guy's a mess. 
You don't bathe them? Oh, we try. But that one just loves his mud baths. <laughs> Down there. There he is. Jump over this person? Nope. Yep. <laughs> Fluffy. Do you remain? No, it's back that way. Up there. There must be a shepherd, obviously. <laughs> it's the wrong that I want to push. I'm not sure of the shape of the person there off. Yeah, it's pretty wrong. Over there, there it is. Like I said, this is the graveyard. There's so many of them. Yeah, well, if they're dead, they're down there. Feed the hungry sheep. Got the sheep, one more remain. Damn, you really wolf that down, huh? Mission accomplished. Completed. Our site. Right. I suppose it's time I showed you the upper city. It's back the way we came and up the stairs. Or did you want to look around a bit more first? Uh, I'll leave the pasture. Let's have a land in here first. Uh -huh. right. Go up the stairs. Where are the damn stairs gone? Yeah, who needs stairs? They're there. something your powers could you give me a quick demonstration absolutely not you're not some street performer look i'm sorry but they're not for show ah really i was hoping you'd give me another look but i guess i've seen enough Adi is as good as safe already how many fucking times do i have to tell you i'm not your savior So, this is where the rich folks live. Yep. And they get the best food, the nicest clothes, and the safest part of the city to themselves. They get to run everything just because of who they are. Best not to think about it. Ah, the accident of birth. Curse you, cruel fate. <laughs> yeah. It's her. Don't even look at her. What 
business does someone like that have in this part of the city? <sighs> that boy is here again. Ignore him. He'll clear up <coughs> soon enough. Do you want me to call the guards? Only if she does something. Well, of course she will. We'll see, dear. We'll... <laughs> this is the Tower of... Oh, sorry. I forgot. Hey, uh, don't worry about it. Let's maybe not go in for the full tour, though. Alright. Oh, this tour's still going. Nope, I can't. Invisible wall. This is the mausoleum. Our souls come here when we die. What are you doing here? And you? You belong in the lower city. Yes! You have no right to be here. Neither of you. Be gone! Ugh, oh, of all the people to run into. Frey saved the city! If anyone deserves to be here, it's her! If she wanted, she could turn you to ashes in a heartbeat! But she'd never do that! Isn't that right, Frey? Okay, can you fucking let it go already? What? Why are you angry? What's wrong with you all of a sudden? Hmm. If you want to save your city, do it your fucking self. You're not dragging me into this. This ancient structure is older than Sepal itself, though nobody knows when exactly it was built. It is more than just a building to the Athians. We believe that the souls of the departed come here to rest for all eternity. The precise origin of this belief is unclear, but generations of Athians have treated the mausoleum as a place of worship and reflection, and to this day visitors can be seen Offering up thanks and prayers. What about our tour? There's so much still to see. I don't need a stupid fucking tour. Alright. Yeah. What's this little kid? Yep. You're the criminal who came from the corruption, aren't you? Well, stay out of the upper city. We don't want you tainting us with it. Damn, you can't use his, your magic on him. Down the steps. Am I hanging something there? Hey, a kitty cat. You gotta pat the cat. <laughs> Look at him, he looks like he's standing guard. That, or he's still petrified after everything that's happened. Yeah, I guess they do have a pretty keen sense of danger, don't they? Yeah. No, you can't save it. What happens if I go again? <laughs> Look at him. He looks like he's standing guard. Uh, that, or he's still petrified after everything that's happened. Yeah, I guess they do have a pretty keen sense of danger, don't they? This plays the same stuff. Please, Frey, wait! Listen, okay? I never said I'd help you. With anything. Ever. Got that? I... I'm sorry! I just... I got carried away, I suppose. Look! Let me take you to one last place. Fuck no! Come on, please! I'm not sure he's gonna take no for an answer. <sighs> one look. At whatever the hell it is, and I'm out. Thank you so, so much! Come on, it's this way! Wait, wh what the hell is this? Thank you so much for saving the city! Oh, 
mom said we're not supposed to talk to you, but, but you helped us. Thank you, Frey. They've been wanting so badly to show you how grateful they are. Uh, I... it was nothing. That's not true. And you know it. We're all in debt. Me included. Mm -hmm. Wait, is... is this why you came and found me in the first place? Pilo! You'd better not let me find you slacking off, you little runt. Oh, no! Where the heck are you? Get here! Now! Oh, no! It's the boss! Sorry, Frey. I have got to go. I've had bosses like that. <laughs> a bunch of flowers Frey received from the children of Sapel as a thank you for protecting this city. The bright red blooms were all grown within the walls of Sapel and the neatness of the presentation suggests that a kindly adult probably lent a helping hand. Ah, oh, that's nice. Completed. What an excitable young man. You know, I've never gotten flowers before. Then let's hope it never happens again, shall we? Note, I'm going to finish up. I'll see you again soon. Bye.